Hey, today I had a problem because I wanted to build my game for Play Store and I couldn't do it because the latest version of Unity doesn't have API of level 29. This is weird anyway, but um, it's the way it is. You can't update it through the Unity because if you click update Android SDK, you will get some error saying that you have to do it manually anyway. So um, let's just close it and see what's the structure of our folders in Unity. So let's go to edit and to preferences. And here, if you scroll it down, you've got Android SDK tools installed with Unity. So let's copy the path and let's open it in our Explorer. So I will just paste it in here. And as you can see, if we go to platforms, we've got Android 28 installed with Unity. And we need Android 29 in order to be able to build our game for Play Store. So how can we do it? Probably there is some another way as well, but I found it easiest to use Android Studio. So you have to download it and install the Android Studio. I will just open it because I've got it installed already. So as you can see, I've got no Android SDK found. I will click next. Probably when you will do it, it will look a little bit different and I will show you later how to do it. So let me just wait a little bit so that it's being done. Okay, this is installed. We can click on finish. And here's our Android Studio open now. So you can go to configure and SDK manager. And normally this is how you would open your Android Studio. The way I open it was because I deleted those SDKs before just to show you how it's being done. So now you can just go to Appearance System Settings and Android SDK and see that the API level 30 and 29 is installed already. If it wasn't, then you would just click on it, apply and it would get installed. So now we need to go to this path specified. As you can see, both Android Studio and Unity has this path so that it keeps this SDKs in it. So just copy it and here I've got my Unity SDK folder. So I don't want to change it because I want to keep it open. So I just press and click Shift to open Internet Explorer in the new window and just click in here and paste a new path. So here we go to platforms as well. And as you can see, we've got this Android 29 and Android 30 that we can copy. So just select them and paste them in Unity. But as you can see, you need to specify the actual path to the version of Unity that you are using because each version has different path. So if you have few projects and you want to build games for Play Store on different Unity versions, then you have to paste this SDKs to different paths as well. But you will get them if you just go to Unity to edit preferences and slide down. Of course, here in external tools, if you slide down, you have this Android SDK tools path. So you can copy it and paste it where appropriate. So I will just close it for now and I will go to build settings and I'll go to player settings and I will scroll down to other settings, go down to see where is here we've got it. The minimum APL level is 29. So let's leave it an automatic. I will use this API 29 here as well. Okay, so we can close it. If you want, you can build with API 30 already because we downloaded it, but I will show you that this is working with 29. So let me close it. We've got this option to build for Google Play. We can click on build. We can choose the folder. I will just use it on desktop because I will cancel it anyway. And I will just save and let's wait a second to see if this is really working. So starting Android build and soon you should see some different message. So now you can see that it started and everything is fine. So this is how you update your Android SDK.